A look at sports now. High school softball playoffs continuing today with regional semifinal play. Biddeford and Wyndham playing a game that might be talked about for years to come. Seven innings, not enough for this matchup between the two and six seeds in Southern A. Wyndham's Brooke Gary did not allow a hit through the first ten innings. Meanwhile, Biddeford played some great defense. Alexis Libby with a great backhanded play at third base right here. And then Wyndham with a scoring chance, but Baylor Wilkinson Fields the grounder and dives to beat the runner to first base to end the inning. It would stay scoreless until the 13th when Wyndham scores a pair of runs. The second on the single by Ellen Files, which knocks in Ella Wilcox. Biddeford rallying in the bottom of the inning. Hannah Goslin with the infield single that scores one run to tie the game. And then the Tigers have the go-ahead run thrown out at the plate. But in the bottom of the 14th, Goslin scores on a pass ball. And Biddeford wins it 3-2. to two. They're going to face Marshwood in the regional final. In the Southern A baseball competition, we've got top-seeded Thornton Academy hosting fifth-seeded Falmouth. T.A. shortstop Jeremiah Chessy with a nice diving stop in the middle, and he gets the force out at second base. Chessy then comes through with his bat in the second inning when he singles to left field to knock in Christian Schaefer. Cody Bowker outstanding on the mound in this game. He struck out 12 in the 3-1 Thornton Academy win. They face South Portland in the regional final now. In Class C, girls lacrosse. Top-seeded Freeport hosting 8th-seeded St. Dom's. Taryn Cloutier getting past the defender for the early goal to give upset-minded St. Dom's the lead. Freeport ties it up, though, a couple of minutes later when Meg Driscoll sets up Hannah Groves for the goal. And a little bit later on in this one, Kate Tracy draws three defenders and then finds a wide open Meredith Feller for the goal. Freeport wins 18 to 9 and they will host Lake Region in the semifinals. In